What's up everybody? I don't need this helmet now, but I will in a moment because I'm doing a very, very different kind of review. This is the Honda Moto Compacto, a $995, 41 pound, around half a horsepower electric scooter, sit down electric scooter, that will go up to 15 miles an hour, get you about 12 miles on a single charge, which you can recharge in about three to three and a half hours on a one town outlet. This is part of Honda's full reach electrification strategy. This is your final mile or two to your destination in an urban area. This is the short spurts to get places here and there. And it's really interesting. Let's take a closer look. So the seat comes off. There is a suitcase latch on the bottom, the slide, that holds up, there's a magnet that holds it flat, and that tucks into the body. The bar rotates. This drops into the gap. The rear wheel slides into the body. All right, magic has happened and now this is all folded up. This is the 41 pounds that I was talking about. And yes, that kickstand goes up as well. So it's pretty darn easy to carry. It's like a pretty heavy piece of carry-on luggage. But how do you turn this large briefcase into a scooter? Well, it does take a few steps if I'm honest. Let's start with the first one, the fun one. There are these little kickstands here. Okay, kickstands are up on either side. Now release the wheel. There is a release on this side. Undo it, twist. Now the wheel will slide out. Handlebars are next. Actually, before I get to the handlebars, I have to put this back in place. Okay, now Time to get the handlebars. There's a push to release right here. Handlebar comes out like that. From here, I lift this up like this. Release, lock that one again. Now, I twist the handlebars in place. And then these have a lock right here. And there are these little teeth that it has to mesh in with right there. So now we have handlebars. Now you need a seat. Oh, I have to latch this. This clip right here does that. Okay, I have a seat. This is what the seat looks like. And it's got all these little mechanical bits right there to latch in place. Twist like that. Get this around it. Lock it in place. It slides in like this. And now I have a Moto Compacto. All right, now that it's assembled, let's go over a couple of quick things. It has one single rear drum brake right there. The tires are non-inflated. These are airless tires, just solid rubber tires. Interesting fact, the rear tire is actually softer than the front tire. So even if you lock this brake up, kind of like a big wheel, it won't lead to bad flat spotting. Your accelerator is this lever right here. And because it's in the second drive mode, it'll start moving even though I'm not even on it. The first drive mode, you have to be going one mile an hour before it'll even engage. It's a little safety feature. You have the single brake right here and a little bell right there. The weight limit is 265 pounds. So no, it's not for everybody, but it is for a lot of people and it is for a lot more people than a lot of other scooters like this. So yeah, oh, the body is plastic. The frame underneath is aluminum. The electronics are relatively simple, but you do have headlights in the front and the back, and you do also have where you recharge it right there. As you can see, pretty simple handlebars for turning. That's how you carry it when it's all put away. Uh, yeah, let's go for a ride. There's a power button right here. Hold it down. It lights up, shows you battery status, shows you headlight status, and what drive mode you're in. Yes. Even electric scooters have drive modes. One click turns on and off the lights. Two clicks switches drive modes. Now I'm in the second drive mode. 
The second dry mode is full power. Of course I want full power. All right, helmet's on. Kickstand up, let's go. just as I like to do with everything, it is time for an acceleration test. I am in mode two, which is the more powerful mode, and we'll see how it goes. <sighs> Brake test. There it goes, it starts and stops. $995 for this pretty darn convenient Moto Compacto. It's not fast, it's not exhilarating, but it's functional. It's functional, it's easy, and I have to say, at $995, it's refreshingly low priced as well. I find it really fascinating that Honda gave it drive modes, but I think that there's a lot of interesting little details of this that make it really pretty compelling. And there are two ways to get it as well. You can actually buy it as an accessory if you're buying a Honda, or you can go to the website and buy it directly. So yeah, it's cute. It's adorable almost. It's very customizable with this plastic right here. And as you saw, it's not that heavy. So. This is an interesting choice and definitely a lot less frustrating than those rent-a-scooters you see all over the cities. I'm Robin Warner. Thank you for watching.